Guys, in this video of LinkedIn marketing course, I'm going to show you how to create LinkedIn business manager account. So basically, I'm going to give you the whole tutorial about LinkedIn business manager that how you can create it. And then I'll show you the basic overview that how you can use LinkedIn business manager. And earlier, this feature was not there. This is kind of a Facebook's feature that Facebook has business manager, which people calls it BM. So same LinkedIn has done it with their platform. They have created a business manager account where you can manage multiple businesses with the same or with a single account, right? Now let's directly jump into the LinkedIn platform and learn how to create a business manager account. So guys, as you can see right now, I'm in my LinkedIn account now let's first click on for business and go to advertise because to create a business manager account first i need to access my campaign manager account and when i uh, i'm able to access the campaign manager account let me open my one account over here add account over here once the ad account is opened you'll be able to see the left hand side menu over here so you need to scroll a all the way down and here at the end of this menu you'll be able to see business manager so let's just click on business manager and it will redirect you to another page which is the landing page of business manager so this is how you can see this is the landing page of business manager and in order to create you just need to click on create business manager now it is getting loaded now Obviously, business manager is for business. So you need to enter the name of your business manager account. So let's add the name. I'm adding MF Global BM, right? BM means business manager, right? So this is the name I have given MF Global BM. And now if you want, you can add the logo of your business as well. This is totally optional, but you should add because it looks a, a bit professional right because you are creating your own business manager and here you can see one more thing that right now still it is on beta phase right so they are testing everything and if everything goes right they will make it properly live right so now let me add the logo because our bm or business manager account should also look legit right so i'm just selecting this one okay i don't want to open it let me search here the logo and let me change it to icon yes this is our marketing funders logo so i'm going to select the logo and it is added now it is lo not looking that much good because of the orientation but anyways let's use this one this is totally the demo for the demo purposes right now here you need to enter the email your work email basically so let me add the work email Once it's done, it is asking that how will you primarily use this business manager, manage my business or manage my clients or other businesses. So it is totally up to you that what you want to choose the option as a digital marketing agency, we are going to choose this one. But if you want to create a business manager to manage your own business, you can select this. There's no any uh, problem if you select that option, right? Now, after selecting with your preference, just hit the create button and your BM will create. Basically, now I need to check the confirmation on my Gmail. Let me check it. Basically, they want to verify it, right? So let it open. And here I got the mail directly from LinkedIn. So I need to confirm the invitation basically to create the business manager account. Now it is asking to confirm your identity and create your business manager. So to confirm my ID, basically I need to log in again. So I have already logged in into this browser. That's why it is not going to ask me some extra information. So open business manager. Because basically it was asking me to confirm my uh, identity. That's it. Now, as you can see, everything is here. The BM or the business manager on LinkedIn is created now. Even you can see the ID as well. It is, uh, it has a different, basically it has a specific ID as well. Like we do have in our ad accounts, like 
let me show you as you can see in our ad groups campaign groups we do have our ids right as you can see here let me go back again over here the business manager now in business manager we'll be able to see these options right so right now i'm in the home section and in home section you'll be able to see these page options which are here as well so let's start with the partners so if as i already told you that i have created this account to manage my clients or other businesses so how you can manage those uh, other businesses or your clients businesses you can use this partner option basically here you need to enter the id of your clients business manager account and you can click on add partner and if the client approves from his or her side the ad account basically the business manager account will be added into my account right so this is how you can add the partners right and then you can manage those accounts from directly from here now we do have people option so what why people is for so let's say you want to assign your business manager's task or business manager management to another person to your team so what you can do is you can add the people like we do in our campaign manager we can do here as well you just need to click on the invite people you need to enter their email address by which they have created their linkedin account and then you need to select the role the first one is admin which is totally like you the owner of account and then the second one is employee and the third one is contractor so the most uh, logical one or the most useful one is the employee just select it and here you need to enter the uh, email id let me add the email id and once you add the email id you need to select the business role and hit the invite button now once the user basically the whom you have sent the invitation they select not select they confirm or they accept the invitation from their side they will be able to become a employee in this business manager account and even you can check out that how or what are the things they'll be able to access let me click on got it again and here you'll be able to see that uh, employee can access and work with assigned ad account and pages so to employees you can assign ad account and pages now here you can connect ad accounts of your clients as well and even your own is ad accounts as well right so for that you need to click on ad accounts and here you will be able to see options let me decrease the size of this a little bit so that you can see properly now in click on once i click on ad accounts you will be able to see these three options the first one is claim ownership then claim owner basically this is for the bulk option let's say you have multiple ad accounts of which you want to claim the ownership and then the last we have request access so this is for the clients ad account of which you want to request the access from here you need to send the re basically request you need to request the access and if they approve from their side your client or your partner then you'll be able to access that account in this business manager account right now if you want to add your own ad account so for that you can use these two options claim ownership so let's see let's see as you can see i have clicked on claim ownership by id so what you have to do is you need to enter the ids of your ad account so let me show you once if i go here and if i copy the id this is the id which i have copied or let's copy of this uh, let's copy the id of this one digital marketing services i clicked on more click on copy id i went to business manager i paste the id over here and click on add and it is showing something went wrong please contact customer support or error. some error is getting basically some error is occurring otherwise it will directly add to your account basically the ad account will be added into your business manager account so as i already told you that this is in the beta phase right now that's why some lag is there right that's why otherwise you can try the second method as well you can create a cvs basically you can download this template and you can add all the ad accounts into that template like we do have here 
multiple ad accounts so you can add all the ad account ids and you can submit it here and then you can claim all the accounts basically you'll be able to add those accounts here in this business manager same goes with the page as well if you want to add your own page you can click on add pages and you can search the page here let's see we do have the let me check the name first of our ad account so for that i need to not add account of our page so our page name is marketing funders global this is the demo one that's why i don't know the name yeah marketing funders global demo so what you can do is we do have the ownership of that page so i can directly uh, add that page into my business manager so i need to search marketing funders global demo as you can see i need to understand verify and all and hit the add button and the page has been added in the same way you can add the ad accounts which you owns into your account you can add those accounts as well but due to some glitch we are not able to add that those accounts right now right but in future you will be able to do that now as you can see the page has been added now if you want to request access the basically if you want access of your client's page your partner's page for that you need to use this option request access you can search the page again page again like marketing fund as the original one this one is the original one now for this you need to request access like right now we do have matched audience matched audience is kind of the data you get from uh, your ad accounts and then the revenue attribution where you can add or connect the crm so that you can understand that from where the revenue is coming or how the sales is going right basically you'll get whole idea about the revenue then invoices invoices is basically you'll be able to see all the invoices which you have spent on ads then we do have the settings where you can connect any crm if you want and here you can do the extra like you can change the logo you can change the name of your bm or the business manager account so this is how you can manage i hope you understood how you can create your business manager account on linkedin and even how you can connect all the things how you can transfer all the things here and how you can manage everything from your business manager although this is right now this is on beta phase but still it is very useful if you want you can use it now let's wrap up this video here i hope this video was helpful for you and if you like this video don't forget to hit that subscribe and like button i'll be meeting you in the next video till then bye bye